Welcome to Tricky's Kitchen where delicious food is made easy. Today, Tricky and her daughter will show you how to prepare a strawberry cream cake. This is a classic of the British kitchen and a summer favorite. These are the ingredients for the cake flour, the ingredients for the batter, and the ingredients for the whipped cream. Preparatory steps, just grease a 13 by 9 inch baking tin and line it with grease proof or parchment paper. Also preheat the oven till the temperature shown. Let's prepare the cake flour. So add two tablespoons of corn flour into a measuring cup. This is a one cup measuring cup and top up the measuring cup with plain flour. Then sift it into a bowl and there we have prepared the cake flour. Let's prepare the cake batter. So add in the egg whites and the cream of tartar to another mixing bowl. Whisk well. Gradually add in the sugar and whisk. Continue to whisk until the mixture reaches stiff peaks and set the egg whites mixture aside for later use in this recipe. Now take another mixing bowl and add in the egg yolks and whisk. Now add in the oil, water and vanilla extract and whisk until well combined. Now sift in the powdered ingredients into the egg yolks mixture. That's the cake flour that we prepared in step one, the baking powder and the salt. Now whisk until just combined. Remember, do not over mix. Now spoon in the egg whites mixture that we had prepared and set aside earlier and gently fold it in. Again, do not over mix. With this, we have prepared the cake batter. So spoon the batter into a prepared baking tin and spread it out so that the base of the baking tin is evenly covered. Now smooth in and level the top with a palette knife and bake in a preheated oven for about 12 to 15 minutes or until the cake is done. Then remove from the oven when done. You will know the cake is done when a skewer inserted into the center of the cake comes out clean. Also, the cake should be gently springy and should have left the sides of the tin. Then transfer onto a wire rack to cool completely. You will notice a change of hands because from this point on, Tricky's daughter takes over and will do the decoration of the strawberry cream cake. Allow the cake to cool down and then divide it into two equal halves. Now wash and pat dry the strawberries, then cut them into thick slices and set the thick slices apart. Now let's prepare the whipped cream. So add in the listed ingredients to a large mixing bowl. That's the double cream, sugar, vanilla extract and a pinch of salt. Whip until the mixture just holds its shape. Then spoon the whipped cream into a piping bag and set aside. Now take one half of the cake and pipe whipped cream all over it. Now evenly spread whipped cream all over using a palette knife. Now neatly arrange the thick slices of strawberry that we had chopped and set aside.
and then pipe whipped cream all over the layered strawberries. And once again, evenly spread it all over using a palette knife. Now place the second half of the cake over the whipped cream layer and repeat the previous step that is pipe and spread whipped cream evenly over the top. Now use a serrated knife to neatly trim off the sides of the cake to get the perfectly sharp corners and sides. It's a good practice to refrigerate the cake for at least 4 hours to get those sharp corners and smooth sides. Now use a started nozzle and pipe whipped cream in a decorative spiral over the four quarters of the cake. Finish off by topping the cake with strawberry slices and leaves. At this point you can use your creativity to decorate the cake as you wish. You will also notice that the sides and the corners are very smooth and sharp. Then neatly slice the cake into four quarters and transfer onto a serving tray and enjoy it with a cup of hot favorite evening tea. So there you have it. A strawberry cream cake, a classic of the British kitchen and a summer favourite. So thank you for stopping by, do hope you will give this recipe a try. Have lots of fun in the process as you toy. And most of all, don't forget to enjoy. Tricky's Kitchen has lots of other delicious recipes that you would like to try out. So be sure to click on the video link on the screen right now and watch another video and subscribe to Tricky's Kitchen if you haven't yet.